An official 139 pounds. This Julius in Dongo. Coming by way of KO. Universally recognized. Nebraska. Terrence. Protect yourself for all time. Fight hard, fight clean. Good luck to both of you. Joe Tessitore, Teddy Adam, the third best fighter in the world, at least in my estimation. I think Endon goes up for the challenge. Southpaw against the Southpaw. Crawford is listed as an orthodox fighter, but when he fights lefties, well, different ways to handle it. Switching from right to left, so just look forward to that as this fight continues to progress. A good looking counter left hand from Crawford as. And Dongo lunged in. One other thing that Crawford is that you missed. He's faster. Quicker hands. And the power hand, the backhand for the southpaw. Crawford, one of the best switch hitters in the game, can do it either way. Comes out, as Teddy said. He's going to meet fire with fire and be in that southpaw stance. But he is equal power no matter which stance he's in. And Dongo to meaning his belt. Remember, he won his first world title with a first round knockout. It was the size, the length, the speed, all those things. But one thing that shouldn't be missed that I think favors Crawford, the intellect. He's smarter inside that squared circle. And Crawford is finding out that Ndago probably moments ago end of one here for all four titles. We talked about earlier about Crawford having more dimensions. Well, you see right here some of those dimensions. You can set traps. Take a little step back, get Ndango to reach a little bit, give up his height, and counter with that right hook from the southpaw position. One of nine punches he connected with. Walk in, move your head, bring your feet, come behind your jab, and get close. Another way, the way that Crawford did early with that replay, you saw it. Step back, set a trap, entice the taller guy to give up his height, to come to you. I'm On paper, about. it's a three-inch height advantage. There's a swinging, swiping left hand from Ndongo. Crawford gets right back into the kitchen, and the crowd reacts. Pass a hand from Crawford. No doubt about it. And more explosive powers. You'll see the shots that you need to land. Good shot from Crawford right there, but Ndongo still just a little tight for my taste. And then on the back end, a right hand to the body, and that's going to be a knockdown score. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you okay? You want to continue? Give me your gloves. A lot of time, bro. I think he might have got up too fast. He's still. That's a great point. Let's see how he reacts. Terrence Crawford is a great finisher. And perhaps... A see how straight they are? How concise they are? Crawford's get there faster. Nearly clipped him again. Came hunting with a right hook as they tie up in the final seconds of round two. Big round for Bud Crawford. Knockdown right here, right hand to the body. You're going to see the left hand coming up right there behind the ear. Percent. I talked about it in the fight plan. How does Crawford deal with southpaws? Just becomes one, a pretty damn good one. When we mentioned it earlier, Teddy. It's the opponent and the best fighter that he's faced in his career. Not the case for Crawford. Crawford has a long list of quality opposition that's prepared him for this moment right now. Sure about what he wants to do offensively. Left Another uppercut tried to split the guard, and Dongo came forward that time. But you can see some doubt, to your point, Andre. He is fat with those left hands, Teddy. There is opportunity throughout the night. Up in two different ways. Punch in between. Another knockdown score with a vicious body shot. Oh, my, what a body shot. Eight, nine, ten. Bud Crawford is the undefeated, undisputed champion.
Hawkins, this bud's for you. You got yourself an undisputed champion. Here, talking about with five punches, you can punch in between them. And that's exactly what Crawford did. Just watch. Wide punches create holes. There's a big hole underneath. Left hand to the body by the southpaw of Crawford. Right hook misses. Left hand to the body. The follow-up doesn't. Young fighters out there, that's the benefit.